the old hickory metal bat. What up, what up? Will and Trace here with the Baseball Bat Bros. And today we got a new funky BB core, man. We got the old hickory metal bat. This is a BB core. This is called the C2, and it's actually a two piece hybrid, even though it doesn't look like it. Let's check it out. All right, fellas, here's a closer look at the old hickory C2 BB core. This is going to be one of the cheaper two piece hybrids. And I know you guys are like, Will, that's a one piece, man. It's actually not. So, this is definitely the most unique two piece hybrid I've seen where they actually fuse the composite handle directly into the alloy barrel and do like a thick layer of paint over it. So, you can't even see. I don't know why you wouldn't like show the connector piece. If you look really closely, you can kind of see like a warp in the barrel shape on the edge there. Uh, where the connector piece actually is. So I think they're just going for a bit more end load here with having a lighter handle and a heavier alloy barrel. So let's try this out. I know freaking nothing about this thing other than that little fun fact about the handle. Let's see how the old Hickory C2 swings it, man. We'll take some hacks with a bat like the goods at the end to see how it compares. All right, no idea what to expect here. Don't know what it's gonna sound like. It feels very heavy right off the bat. Good tacky grip, only $250. Not that expensive for a two-piece hybrid. Let's see, boys, I don't know what to expect. Bro, it's heavy, yeah. like gunner heavy. Very heavy. Yeah. yeah, out over the plate, I can get it. Dude, it's a log, wow. Jam shot. Dude, it's so hard to get to that inside pitch. Just no barrel control. God, not much sweet spot towards the hands. Yeah, I thought I feel like I should have smoked that ball. I feel like right here is nothing. I mean, initially, the barrel obviously is huge, yeah. but it just doesn't, this doesn't really ride. No. It feels, I, I just feel like I couldn't even generate enough bat speed to get it to. Yeah. I can do more damage with a lighter bat. Way more. Hands a little bit. One more. Let's see if I can get the barrel to a ball here. That smoked, come on. Decent. That's, oh. that's gotta be it. Serious? <laughs> Can't get into one much better than that. I, <laughs> I guess we'll see right now. Dude, oh my the goods God. is lighter. What? Get out, ball. Oh, wall, wall, barely. Still, that's the furthest ball I've hit by a long shot. And that was high and inside, and I was not touching that thing with the old hit. Hey, y'all. Where's the difference? Oh, that's hey, the difference. Yeah. I can actually get to the ball that's up and in. Oh my gosh. Yeah. It's coming up hotter, bro. Oh, oh yeah. Woo! That was peace. <laughs> yep. Damn, done. All right, guys, there you have it. The uh, old Hickory C2, Trace and I agreed 100%. 
Um, it was pretty dang heavy swinging, even felt heavier swinging than the goods. And I think one thing that really contributed to that was how the old hickory, it was very end loaded and most of the performance was towards the end of the bat. Balls out over the plate that you got out here performed really well. Down towards the hands, it was not super great though. Really similar to a bat like the Warstick Hawk 2 or the Warstick Gunner, honestly. Whereas the goods, if you get beat, really similar to a bat like the Meta Power, for example, really, really good towards the hands still. You can still launch the ball pretty well and it feels pretty good when you get beat a little bit and it still just felt lighter overall. This also had a bigger sweet spot and it hit the ball a little bit further, at least for us. We, we needed the extra bat speed, I guess. So all around all three categories, I got the goods edging out the old Hickory C2. Just a little too heavy, man. If we could just bring that sweet spot a little bit more down towards the hands, I think just an overall more balanced swing weight in general would really do good things for this. Great sound, really stiff handle. Honestly felt like a one piece alloy to me. Didn't really notice much uh, two piece flex out of it, but it sounds sick and if you're a really strong guy you can make this thing work really well probably i just easier bat to hit with for sure all right guys thanks for hanging out today if you like the video we'd appreciate if you drop a like subscribe to the channel thanks for hanging out y'all we will see you next time oh uh, that was kind of peace 300 <laughs>